A lot of people are noticing more mosquitoes. They're getting more mosquito bites and they're trying to figure out what to do. I'm Joe Moeller in Las Vegas. I talked to one veterinarian who says it's also important to remember your dogs when it comes to mosquitoes. This year they're horrible. The Summerlin resident Chris Bunker is feeling the bite. Every time we walk outside, even if it's for five seconds, we end up with a with a sting of some sort. Mosquitoes also target their dogs. So we've got uh, two small dogs. Apparently, like the little black mosquitoes that are here, they, they will sting your pets. An expert from UNLV confirmed with us recently it's a growing problem here in the desert. I'd say within the last two to three years, we've seen a massive uptick in mosquitoes, uh, partially because the weather is so weird and now it is explosive here. The bugs can also attack your four-legged friends and can cause heartworm from a bite. The disease results in severe lung disease, heart failure, other organ damage, and death in pets, mainly dogs, cats, and ferrets. The worms spread through the bite of a mosquito. We haven't seen a whole lot of it here because we haven't had a ton of mosquitoes. Tropicana Animal Hospital veterinarian Babette San Martin yeah, says she hasn't seen a lot of heartworm cases, but it doesn't mean it couldn't become a problem. The Heartworm Society map shows in the past it has been more common in other states, but with more mosquitoes here in the valley, taking preventative measures couldn't hurt. We are seeing more mosquitoes. We're definitely starting to recommend like heartworm preventatives a little bit more, especially just from the fact that prevention is a lot cheaper than treatment. Like once a dog has heartworms, you know, treatment can be really expensive. What does that look like? A couple thousand dollars usually. Wow. Signs to look out for in your pets include a mild persistent cough, reluctance to exercise, fatigue after moderate activity, decreased appetite and weight loss. Preventative medicine like chewable tablets are available over the counter for dogs and cats. I've lived in Las Vegas for 65 years, never mosquitoes. Bunker says it's a good thing he already has a vet appointment. Fortunately, I'm taking my dog in this afternoon. Reporting in Las Vegas, I'm Jumble.